Cracking down on drag racing is keeping Metro police officers busy. City leaders say officers went undercover last night to send a message. News Channel 5's Hannah McDonald tells us about the major stops police made. Nissan Stadium is apparently one of the spots that Metro Police staked out suspected street racers. Then they tagged them for everything from excessive engine noise to unauthorized use of blue lights. Using intelligence, city leaders say police officers were privy to three meetups where street racers might be. Tennessee Speed Sport in Goodlettsville was another one of those locations that undercover officers had eyes on. Some 30 vehicles were counted across the locations, which also included this parking lot near Rivergate Mall. Council member Courtney Johnston said when cars started leaving the locations, drivers were stopped and cited. But it wasn't just those three spots that police monitored from 7.30 to 1.30 a.m. Police also patrolled roads like Murfreesboro Pike looking for drag racing and reckless driving. It was back in September the department announced it would be stepping up these kinds of patrols since police have impounded countless cars. Saturday night, police reported 25 violations, including speeding, failure to stay in one lane, and use of bright and dazzling lights. There were five arrests. Getting caught drag racing could soon land offenders behind bars for up to a year. There is a state legislator who is trying to change the law and likely a Offenders would also have their car taken away permanently. At Nissan Stadium, I'm Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5.